Hey everybody, I'm Sam, and I'm Will, and we are Working Title. <laughs> Guys, we're back. It's Mob Psycho time. This is season one, episode three, uh, an invite to a meeting, dash, simply put, I just want to be popular. popular. You know, Food. middle school, middle school relatable, you know. Last on, Mob doesn't really know what he wants to do, but everybody wants to decide that for him. <laughs> Today, he made a choice. Jim Arc. To become jacked. So, leave a like if you too feel the need to enter into a Jim Arc. Subscribe to the channel if uh, you enjoy these videos. We just begun our Mob Psycho journey, so we'd like you to stick around. Um, and you can also check out the Patreon as well, because over there you can get some early access, as well as uncut uh, versions of these videos. And, for now, as always, we're going to punch it. See ya! Boom! Come here. Uncut game. Oh! Body improvement! Fight on. Fight on. They don't make a man a pill, you know what makes them feel like? Yeah, these bad boy right here. <laughs> Where is he at? Where's Body and perfect! <laughs> oh, poor well, you guy. Gotta, you gotta start somewhere, you know? Oh, uh, hey. uh -huh. gosh, he's miserable looking. Mm -hmm. Bro, these guys are grown men. Shall we? Oh, did they join? <laughs> Oh my gosh, they don't even use the room. It's just a storage for them. I don't want to become athletic. <laughs> Makes sense. Aww. Who would have yeah. known? His ability has actually turned him more lazy. That's yeah. insane. That makes... I mean, I believe that. See, look. Oh my gosh, dude. Okay, well, now they believe it. Ah, okay. okay. <laughs> it's like, you ever see those videos of, like, the people pretending they have powers on to TikTok? push To push bottles. Yeah! <laughs> That's... I saw this one, it was, like, four years of my journey. <laughs> Oh, that's so funny. Of course he wants to be popular, dude. What? Hey! Wow. Imagine she gives the book to learn telepathy, and he actually... He learns it. Yeah, he, like, actually does. Holy shit. That would be really cool. Imagine this kid being able to read people's minds. I actually genuinely believe it won't help him. It wouldn't help him understand people at all. Of course he wants to read the girl's mind. He's so scared. Yeah, this guy already has telepathy. <laughs> Just by knowing. Reading people. No. I oh, I don't like, like this. this, yeah. This is how you get kidnapped. This is how we get erased. Go check out that vi video playlist. Why are you going LOL. with her? Into an elevator, Mob, what are you doing? The trendiest gathering. I don't like Dimple Sama all of a sudden. No way a suspicious group. Okay, I do not like this. Hello <laughs> well. Yeah. So weird. <laughs> He's gonna get sacrificed. Ah, don't touch me! Bro pulled up to the eyes wide shut meeting. Yeah, literally. I 
was gonna say uh, the girl. <laughs> hey. hey guys, how's it going? He just like points, shoots, and makes people laugh. <laughs> Here. Talk about old popularized videos on YouTube. Remember, like, real um, gatherings like this where people would make. Oh, what is it called? Where you, like, make people, like, um, hypnotized. Oh, yeah, like, yeah. hypnotized Hypnotize. videos. Yeah. Easy to suggestion. <laughs> <laughs> Why? The no recession. recession. Oh. <laughs> He's like, oh. Gosh. The Kool Aid's coming next, boys. That's all we need. Scam. What's with everyone being a scam artist in this universe? I don't know. I don't trust anyone in this world. But she came here intentionally. Yeah, Kirkus, you're this. right. Ah. How? Is there like laughing gas in the in the mask? Oh, there could be something like that. Or you, or you could just be a powered person. Like yeah, we don't know is. how many powered people or how that works in this world. I'm sure you'll find a job now. <laughs> yeah, they look like monsters or a uh, meat canyon. It feels like a meat canyon type thing. Yeah, I hate oh. it. And that, yes. First-hand experience, son of a bitch. No. Don't, Don't. give in. Sparkle! Sparkle. <laughs> <laughs> no, don't do this to me. Don't do this to me. <laughs> we can fight. No, Something's no, happened to no. me. Oh, God, I don't like We're this. working title. Yeah. Mobs just like this joint don't work. I'm so depressed. Mm. The first one to challenge his uh, religious control. Right. This music's super eerie too. Yeah. Why? <laughs> this why? Why? This is like a YouTube video. Fifty-eight percent to the Damn. explosion. It's because he mentioned milk. His trigger word. Yeah. Mob's just gonna stare straight. <laughs> Did you? Hear that? As if we didn't already know. <laughs> With Did the you? the farmer maggot music in the background. Ew! Ew! This is They're just bad. making themselves laugh the whole way through. Your magic didn't even work on him. I'm actually surprised that Dimple-sama isn't like more like aware that there's something up with the kid if he's able to just make people naturally fall for this hypnosis. Yeah. Was it spoiled? Ooh, oh, look at that animation, that's horrifying. Oh, he's gonna murder people because y'all messed up with his milk. 
Ain't no way. I, I'd be it, throwing it's... hands if somebody messes with my milk. Oh no. Disintegrates them. Holy shit, could you imagine? Oh, did he just, like, expel some energy? Oh, he, so he is a psychic. You're right. He does actually have powers. Mm, dude. He's gonna piss him off. He's gonna explode. Oh, yeah, no. it's happening yeah. this episode, baby. Let's see. <laughs> <laughs> it's already gonna be at 90. Yeah. 92, yeah, that's about that. But... This guy's gonna set him off. Just happened to all the people. He just got super. Oh god. Interesting. Yeah, I'd say. Oh, so because he's had to like restrain himself, that's why he's like this. Okay. Yeah, yeah, he's got some type of complex. Aww. And it makes him freak out. Jeez. This is worrisome, guys. Here we go, Mob Psycho 100. Yeah, now the name Psycho makes sense. Oh no. He's oh, a, he looks like normal too. Did you see say, that? Yeah, he's got like personality in his face. He looks pissed. I didn't even notice. I do like his theme a lot, too. Oh, he is tough. Mm. It almost looks like the one from last episode, too. Just the skin texture and the green look. And the red dimple. Woo! Bro just exploded. He evaporated some of it, or exercised parts of him. Oh! Dude. Damn, I actually like how this thing looks too. He's gonna get fucking. He kinda looks like a domination. <laughs> yeah. He oh. did the anime punch! The wound up. Ooh. Dude, look at the aura around him. That is awesome. His emotions. <laughs> yeah, basically. <laughs> Why is he terrible? I'm just gonna blow him away. <laughs> Damn. Spirits in such consultation office, what a name. Oh, Burger King. Nice. Bro, that's what pissed him off. Why are you saying it again? <laughs> it just goes... <laughs> <laughs> Mob Donald's. Mob Donald's, yeah. He's so dense it didn't work on it. 
poor guy. Oh. Zero. Nice. Okay, we've reset. Zero days since incident. <laughs> yeah. He's like the Hulk, but spiritually. But spiritually. Ah! Oh no! Well, guys, hey, that was um a banger. Yeah, that was actually really good. A banger from Mob Psycho. There you go. Three weeks in for you guys. Sorry you had to wait for us to feel uh, not super lukewarm, but that was cool. Yeah. And now it makes sense, because uh, the main character, like we were talking last, uh, the last post-talk, you know, the character's basically ground zero for protagonist potential, and the potential's at 100. Yeah. Um, no pun intended. Yeah. Literally, I'm sorry. That was not pun intended. I'm going to be cringing at that later, but, um, uh, like, I, he has anywhere but down to go for his character, which is cool. And what's unique is it technically he has some hidden uh, character underneath. Yeah. That's just suppressed because um, he was kind of forced into hiding himself. Yeah. Which is, uh, that's real shit, you know? Yeah. It's tough on a middle schooler, though. Gosh dang. Yeah. That's, I mean, on a, on a non, like, fantasy level... I mean, it makes sense, you know, if you're, if something about you is different than the crowd, you know, and especially, it's, and this is just our, or at least my perception from watching a lot of, like, Japanese culture stuff, like anime, it seems that there's more of a, a divide from, at least, there always was a divide in the U.S. of, like, the weird kids versus, like, the popular oh, kids. Oh, for sure. But I feel like there's just so many, like, different, like, niches and groups and stuff, especially in the past, like, 30 years, that it's probably not as bad as it was in stuff when you watch, like, stuff from, like, the 80s in the U.S. But it seems like even the modern stuff they make about this, it's still kind of that way, where it's, like, if you're weird, you can't, like, put yourself out there. So then you have to become more recluse. And in this sense, for him, it means he has to hide his powers... But it also means hiding, like, every bit about himself. His emotions, his, like, personality. And so he's become such a square, for lack of better terms, yeah. that it's made him into... Uh, literally. Literally. A, literally a psycho. He, he a, was a, a zombie. A, 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 a zombie psycho and then, like, a legitimate psychopath later on. Jeez. It's funny, too, because I thought the name Mob Psycho was going to be along the lines of just, like, a, like he, he the type of psychic he is is a psycho. You know what I mean? Not literally that he is going to explode if he maxes out his emotions at any given time. Yeah, no, I didn't. I actually, that was surprising to me, too. I didn't think it, that's how it was going to be. I mean, the, the, technically speaking, the two episodes had hinted to, like building up but it was weird too because i feel like every time they showed it and i'll have to go back when i see it but yeah w w during the moments when um it would show the numbers either going up i feel like the things that it was saying were different like sadness <laughs> like uh, we weirdly enough i didn't feel like it was always saying like the power was going up i thought it was actually like some of it was like bits because i felt like one of them one of the moments that it was, but it's a different. It, you're referencing like two different things. There was one about like how sleepy he was, and that was at zero. Right. But every time it like leveled up, that was his explosion. Explosion. So it was like mob site or mobs explosion, and then it went from zero to you know but like, twenty, thirty, a hundred. Yeah. But like any time we would expect an illicit reaction to happen from him, it was just still at bottom, no matter what. Yeah. I mean, th this episode, I think he literally jumped from, like, 50 to 100, you know. Well, I wonder where his love meter was, because that's, like, the only thing that still seemed to, like, be outside of the suppression yeah. is the the love, because that, that's what carried him to do the, the gym the gym, gym arc. arc. Yeah. Um, did we get a number on that? Was there ever a number I can't scale remember. shown? I can't remember. Definitely be something you'll have to yeah, back check on back on and see. 
but uh, well, t- today's episode it did start with the J Mark, and it went really piss poor to the point that he basically got flopped back into the telepathy class. Um, we learned that the girl had been trying to practice telepathy on her own, so she can speak with extraterrestrials. You know, I get that. Why? Who wouldn't? Yeah, you know, who, who wouldn't, wouldn't want to try? To? Uh, I also I do love that. I love that this these episodes are kind of making us reflect back on like things that you would do in middle school yeah. as we said the the classic trick where you like put force against well what was it so basically it's like so if you put like put your hands out like this oh and yeah, then right. you would force yourself out. out and you do this for like 30 seconds and then it you would be feel the ball of well no but then you do the other way so you try to push out then i would hold oh. in and then you would oh. yeah and then when you're done after the 30 seconds you could feel like a ball in between. Right. Yeah. I love those kind of yeah, things. Yeah, yeah, I remember doing that when we were, I remember us doing that when we were kids. And it was so revolutionary, too. But, um, <clears throat> hers failed. Yeah. And we were, I, you know, I think we're right. Like, about, uh, Mob himself. Why did it have to be the name Mob? Because every time I say it, I feel like I'm talking, talking about, about a group. Oh, yeah. It's really hard to mentally get over that little handicap part in my mind. I, okay, also, why is his name Mob? I... I, I can't remember his full name right now. Yeah. Does Mo- is Mob in his name at all or no? We'll have to look it up after yeah. this episode. I don't know why. Maybe it's an acronym. I didn't really under- know yeah. what the Japanese name was. They listed it. It was super quick and then it was gone. Uh, maybe it's an acronym. Maybe it's a bit that somebody came up with as a joke that we haven't been privy, privy to. to. Yeah. Uh, Oh, I, I was saying his uh, his abilities. It seems like he, like we know he's a, a psychic, but in my mind, I'm trying to remember like in standard real life terms, what a psychic is. They can uh, communicate with the dead, right? Yeah. They can, but that's that's generally how I've perceived it. And I also get um, what a medium and a psychic is kind of confused yeah i feel like i've also heard psychics can like read like you know like the crystal ball read into the future right type of thing um or read it like like telepathy or like reading into someone's life um i think in general it seems that the show takes the spin on it as being a psychic means having psychic powers so the tele so like all the things we just listed telekinesis telepathy probably you know, clairvoyance, mind, you know, mind, mind control. control, hypnosis, yeah, like those kind of things. So anything that's like a mind power, he has, or well, psychics have the ability of. Shoot. Yeah. That's wild. Yeah, I actually didn't think it'd be as extensive as it was, but it's actually that's actually pretty cool. Yeah. And I wonder, damn, I guess the girl will never get that ability unless it's, unless you can learn it. Yeah. Or, or unless you're born into it, I don't know, it, Arataka's not having any luck with that, and you'd think if he wanted to be better at it, he would try. Yeah. Uh, but maybe it's just, like, the force. You can't be... Your midichlorian counts too low. I don't know. Maybe you can boost it. Oh. I don't know. Uh, we moved on. What what did happen after we left the girl? Um, That's when he went home. He was walking home. And then he got picked up by oh one gosh, of yeah, the like lady right off the bat. one of the like apostles of this of uh, Dimple Sama or whatever. Like, yeah, Dimple Sama. <laughs> I was gonna make a joke saying like, like I really didn't want the show to get crazier, and then they just like really tripled down on the crazy oh. aspect of the show. We got introduced to a cult. Yeah, three a episodes new, in a new religious cult about laughing and smiling. This world is crazy. Yeah, so Mob got uh, dragged down because basically the lady just saw that he was sad and picked out like any of the things that could be sad. She hit on the love portion that he wanted to be popular and be loved by a girl, so she drags him down. Uh, one of his classmates was down there. She was investigating this because she's like a little like school yeah. journalist. And a guy from the recession. And a guy who just lost his job and was sleeping on a bench. Um, but yeah, so they... The dimple pastor <laughs> comes out. The dimple pastor. <laughs> the dimple oh pastor came out. And um, he basically got them in the crowd and used the masks. And the masks had some hypnotic 
ability. I think it was like the the, the uh, they they use the term like group hypnosis, meaning if you see the group all believe in the idea of it, yeah. then by group default think. you'll just follow suit. So I don't even think it's like the mask per se, but like the belief that this mask has powers because supposedly you've seen other people do it. Right? Like a, no, well, I think he did say it because he was like, dang, the mask actually didn't work on him. He, it, I feel like Dim- Dimple Pastor made it seem like it was actually like a. I mean, he's I mean, like, it's the, I'm sorry. I mean, like, it's the mask is the triggering thing, but it's more like the, it's the thing that's been used as the illusion. Yeah. Like, that's not where the power is coming from, but that's the piece used as the triggering event to. Sure, give yeah. the effect. Maybe I, mean, I don't know. I mean, the guy, the guy's an evil spirit. Yeah, I mean, the guy's an evil spirit too. Yeah. So like, he has he has magic powers. That's a, that's a bare minimum. Either way, it worked on the old man. The girl tried resisting it, and she was like actively like, I don't want to be smiling, and it worked on her. And then Mob basically was like, Hey, uh, this didn't work, and oh, you're this club is not about being coming popular, so I'm out. <laughs> Um, that, that does make me. I brought it up in the episode, but it does make me think back to like those old hypnosis like videos where like they would bring somebody to a school or a college campus. I wonder like what the actual psychology of that is. Yeah, uh, like, someone because who's easily influenced into yeah, like, being like e- easy to suggestion. You choose somebody in the crowd that you feel like is going to be easy to be yeah. like. So, you can suggest, uh, you know, manipulate their mind pretty easy, but it's so weird because they always do like a sleep. It's like a, a click, and I don't, yeah. I don't know how legit it is. Yeah, I'm not I know. Gonna pretend to have an opinion on the matter. Yeah, I mean, it's it's hard to tell, especially with some of the older stuff, like who's a paid actor right. versus like. You know, did you actually get that to work? Or if you have paid actors to then suggest to other people, like if that's like the triggering thing, you you pay somebody to be the 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 actor, and then because it works so well for the actor, all of a sudden you're more susceptible to right, that, yeah. right, right, almost like a um, like almost like a peer pressure thing. Yeah. Like you want to believe it, and then you fall into it. Almost. Yeah. I almost want to just try to get hypnotized because I'm like in my mind I just want to look at the person and be like that didn't work. <laughs> I think I'd be too scared. Yeah, I'd be afraid. I, I would be part low key part of me would be afraid. Of, like, damn, what if he actually hypnotized me? What if he hypnotized me and do some crazy and then I don't know? I think I'm too much of a stubborn ass to be suggested. Yeah, I'll be like anything. No, I'll go in intentionally. I will not ex- sleep. Exactly, I'll go into it expecting to be completely unimpressed. Just like the magic show. Well, I yeah, went, when you were I the went magic in, show. all I wanted to do was deduce it and figure it out because it's all I cared about. It's, that's, that's I didn't. I, I I did not care yeah. about the oohs and ahs. I just wanted to learn from the master himself and see if I could figure it out for myself because that's all I got. I just like I'm a mystery. I'm a, mysteries of the universe is all I care for about sure. for sure. Just for reference, I had a great time though. For reference, we went to a magic show with our friends and Sam is sitting there and he was just like sitting next to me and he's just like. Locked in, so, <laughs> like, so, so locked in. I was so like, intently. and the guy, it was like a comedic like experience. Like he was cracking jokes and doing like little tricks here and there with every with everyone in the crowd. And Sam so just like, I remember somebody. I don't know which one of our friends. They, it was probably Caleb. <laughs> no, somebody looked at me and they're like, "Sam, you're allowed to have fun." Like somebody, else I think said, it was Andrew. <laughs> yeah, he, he was like, said. "Sam, you're allowed to you're allowed to enjoy yourself." I'm like, I'm having a lot of fun right now. Let me be. <laughs> I said, shut up. I said, don't look at my face. It's not telling you what I'm actually feeling. I'm just having a mob moment right now. Yeah, Sam was having a mob moment. Yeah, I'm really feeling this character. I mean, he loves milk, and that's enough for me to like him. Yeah. Fuck Edward Elric. (laughs) Kidding, I like him. But fuck him. (laughs) But fuck Edward. (laughs) All the homies hate a non-milk drinker. (laughs) You know? You know. But yeah, so mob basically, um, you know, he basically, like, pulls every one of the guys like tricks like the they do like a lot la- the mask doesn't work they try and do a laughing contest with milk and he likes it um you know because he likes the milk and then he um the milk seems to be like po- or not poison it's like they, it has something in it, it that makes him laugh um so he basically dispels the- he's like i didn't laugh because of that and almost like he like pulsed his, his psychic energy and everyone became unhypnotized. Yeah. I think that's really 
<laughs> I was joking thinking it was the milk thing, but I think it's the fact that um, they were lying about him feeling something when all he's wanted is to feel something. Yeah. So it's like what really upset him is the idea that he's been seeking, like, not the dopamine, but like the the serotonin or something, like the the feeling of feeling, yeah. and because somebody was like, "Oh, he's he's feeling this," and he's like, "No, like I want to feel." Yeah, it. that definitely. Don't tell me I'm not feeling it. I want to feel it. Yeah, which is, I relate to that shit. And then when the phrase "get a clue" came through, yeah. that brought him back to his past, his childhood. It triggered him a little bit, and now you know, ultimately sent him on his. Explosion yeah. that we got to witness. Yeah, um, and it was cool too. Like they, you, they, like mobs, completely was completely animated differently. Like his face didn't look the same. His facial feature. He didn't just have like a dot for an eye. He had like an iris and everything. It seemed like I, I feel. I mean, it could have just been like glowing with power. Um, but his hair wasn't like the bowl cut anymore. Yeah. You know, everything about him changed and he you know, he had, you know, some pretty good clapbacks to the guy too. He looked, emotion. Yeah. He looked cool. I well, liked I, I liked his look, yeah. It's uh, it's almost a shame that uh he won't look like that, I assume, the majority of the show, because none of the promotions for season one, two and three have him looking like that, at least not yeah. from my recollection. To be yeah. fair, I also don't know if the posters I'm looking at were season two or three. I'm just assuming because they they looked different. Yeah, um, but I I would like more of that. Yeah, I mean, I would. Lo- I think one thing for him it's going to be about is his journey to become a person, being comfortable with who he is, but also, right, like being able to. I mean, I don't know. He seemed to not care about showing his. That's the weird thing is that he basically created this persona of himself by suppressing his abilities. But then on the other hand, like in the beginning of the episode when he was in the gym, he was like, "Yeah, I'm an esper. Like I'm a, I'm a psychic." And they're like, "No, you're not." And then he just starts whipping around like twenty pound weights, and then just drops them. And he's like, "Don't you believe me now?" And it's like, so he clearly doesn't care too too much about hiding it as much. Um, what is an esper, by the way? I don't. I I mean, I think it's like another term for just to swap out psychic and. Uh, someone that can use maybe an Asper is someone that is has telekinesis you know what I mean but just want to read some of the words that he's suppressed I saw relief I'll go back a little bit uh, I saw relief admiration where did that go right there that's it just hit play relief affinity curiosity admiration. satisfaction admiration hit play but again it'll probably show affinity's me. like when you're naturally talented towards a specific thing so like you yeah. can't even like hone a bare skill or like the desire to hone in on something specific yeah like that's such a calm i see that as well that's such an intense thing yeah. to suppress yeah. like when you can't even like force your mind to concentrate on doing one thing well yeah well that's i mean he doesn't even like he doesn't have curiosity he doesn't get satisfied by anything he doesn't I mean, he seems to admire the girl because he has some type of love affection for her, but... Poor guy, son yeah. of a bitch. Yeah, oh, hate, I mean, they didn't hate like, was on there, too. Yeah. Like, but they chose some, like, rather upsetting words to throw in there. It wasn't just, like, sad, happy, like, the basic bare-bone emotions. They're, like, hitting them yeah. with the real ones. Yeah, I think also affinity is more like something you're, like, drawn to. Not just like okay, you, okay. like a talent. Like you have an affinity for comic books or something. Like something knives. like this. Yeah. knives. Yeah, something you. <laughs> Sorry, YouTube friendly. What am I doing? Yeah, what, what, what are you doing? What, We're not that? on another site. What's that? Patreon. Um. Yeah. I don't. Do you have an affinity for thing? I have an affinity for well, milk's the obvious one. Yeah. I'm trying to think what I'm naturally inclined to. What? Now that I just have a funny one I'm not going to say. No, it's not. I'll be appropriate today. Say it! Ass. Jennifer Lawrence. Jennifer Lawrence. Best of friend. Um, yeah, I don't know. I mean, affinity towards. I don't know. Truth. Seeking. Seeking truth. Yeah, I. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. I can't. It's hard to think of. I guess it's hard to like quantify what I feel like. There's a lot of things. Yeah, there's a lot of things that are interesting to me. Drawn to, 
Yeah, well, this was a good episode. I liked it. This was a fun... This was our obviously all recorded in the same night, first three episodes, as you three weeks in are now discovering, but this has been a fun um, trio, and uh, I'm excited to see what comes next in our next yeah. recording. Yeah, me too. Um, this was a fun uh, entry, um, even though I was a little lukewarm in the beginning. Definitely, you know, yeah. Just it grew. Like, Took a little couple episodes, but we're here now. Yeah. Well, How many episodes are in the season? Sorry, just real quick before um, we I think it's, it's like 10, 12, and 12, if I recall right. Is this the... So season 12. one's 12... Season two. 14. Oh, okay. 14, 12. It was more episodes than I even thought. Okay. 12, 14, 14, I think. No, there's uh, 12. No, 12, 14, 12. Oh, yeah. I should be looking at the bigger monitor. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. Um, and then what's the last one? So there's two episodes Mob Psycho. OVAs. Oh, uh, OVAs for Reagan. Okay, well, hey, somebody let us know. When should we watch these OVAs? Oh, it's season three, it says, right? Season three, yeah, OVA, and then. It says season five seven e damn you yeah. what does that even mean man Crunchyroll get your shit together you're so confusing well somebody somebody on Discord hit us up because we probably won't be watching the OVAs anytime soon but for now we love you guys thank you for staying around with us um, also do make sure to check out Patreon if you want to see the entirety of the episodes or of course watching this multiple weeks in advance we're gonna punch it boom. boom. I have an affinity for calling out people's bullshit. That's what I got an affinity (laughs) for.